All right, welcome into the Fenway Park edition of Extra Bases presented by Alta Fiber. Reds don't get to come here very often. As you can see, since 1912, there's so much history here. So let's connect you, take you behind the scenes. Let's go. All right, let's start this bad boy exactly where we just were. There's that sign I was standing in front of. And what this is, that is the Reds clubhouse. These are the stairs going down. That's the sign you see. And let's take it towards the field, folks. Players walk down here. Now look at this tunnel. Think about the great players that have walked this tunnel. All the visiting players since 1912 have walked through here. When you walk through here, you can just feel the history surrounding you. Where'd Babe Ruth sign? Is that what you just said? Yeah, do you know where? I imagine it's probably gone away by now. No. <laughs> this is the inside of the famous scoreboard. Now look at these old school. This is where you take these off. I mean, they are, you can hear them. It's as old school as it gets. And there are tens of thousands of names on here. Of people that come in and sign, including the Reds players that you've seen. But this is the manual scoreboard and I bet it gets super hot in here. All the out of town scores, they're all right here. Three. What'd you sign? Dave. Yeah. What about you, Avi? What'd you sign? The whole clan made it today. The whole Ooh, clan made, made it today. today. Now that is cool. That's really cool. That's pretty cool. I have your name in here, isn't it? Man, it's awesome. I grew up a Red Sox fan, so this you is grew up a Red Sox fan. Yeah, this so cool. this is like really, really cool to you. Yeah, I got goosebumps all over right now. <laughs> For real? Yeah. This is awesome. So much history in here. Yeah, think about the history that's in this place right now. Pretty awesome. What'd you sign? Date, name? Pretty cool stuff, isn't it, Tyler? All right, folks, this is the spot. Remember Carlton Fisk and his wheeling the home run? They put the camera in 1975 right here. It was the first time they ever did it. And this is where they got the shot from. A Fisk in game six winning it. But of course the Reds won in game seven. Got to get that in there. But this is that camera spot in its very, very famous spot in baseball.
autographs are in there? Oh, it's gotta be at least 100,000. 100,000? It's about to be 100,001. What do you think about it? I think this is a perfect spot to do it. I mean, you walk right in, like, I remember that I signed right here. You know, I didn't sign all the way down there where yeah. a bunch of signatures. There's only two other people that, three people that wrote their names here. Right by the small door. Yeah, so I took this little, this little chunk right here in the corner. Nice. Got pesky pole. I signed over there pesky pole earlier. You love this place, right? I mean, you love history. That this is kind yeah, of yeah, yeah. I mean, it's it's uh, very special, man. Just being able to go around the city. We had an off day uh, yesterday, so um, it's really cool. Man. So, yeah. What about being able to pitch here? Yeah, tomorrow's gonna be awesome. Um, to be able to take it all in, and you know, it's always hard on those days to to take in the, the moment, just because you know you're so locked in pitching and wanting to do well. But uh, it'll probably be. One of the most special places that I've played so far. Uh, so looking forward to it. Yeah, cool man. Now most people go to the right to sign. Hunter Green, the ultimate long thinker. He thinks it out. He wanted to be right by the door. So that is where he signed, as he just told you. He's gonna tell you. I took his lead and signed right there. Don't tell anyone. I hope you enjoyed our behind the scenes tour of beautiful Fenway Park. More coming your way. In fact, hit that subscribe button down there at the bottom. Subscribe, spread the word. We'll see you next time on Extra Bases with Jim Day, presented by Alta Fiber.